Welcome back. We're here at Ledyard Bank, right in New London, and joining me now is the new Head of Youth Services at the Tracy Library, Lorraine Keating. Welcome. Thank you. Thanks for joining us. So nice to have our audience meet you. Thank you. I'm when happy did, to be here. When did you come on to the, to the library? I started on October 12th. Mm -hmm. Good. And I was here in t time for the beautiful foliage. Uh -huh. um, coming back to the area, I moved down to the seacoast in 2000. Uh -huh. So I did live in New London. We get um, you back. <laughs> I lived in New London for about nine years before mm -hmm. that. And I worked at the Richards Free Library in Newport, previous to um, Northampton Public Library. And now I'm back at Good. And you've Tracy always Library. you've always been in the children's section. Yes. That's your love. Yes. Super. Enjoy that. Great. Yeah. That's great to have you back. Yeah, yes. very nice to have talent back. Um, tell us a little bit about some of the programs coming up for the children. Oh, we um, we have a lot planned for the winter. We're going to start a Lego and Builders Club mm -hmm. on Wednesdays after school. Oh, that's um, fun. From three to four, and we will have Lego. We will have. We're going to be borrowing a set of. Uh, magnetic building toys from the state library. They have a lending program, mm -hmm. so we'll have those. We will continue our after school cafe, which has been very popular. We actually have it today. We have snacks That's and movies. That's every Thursday. Yes, okay. we're going to be every Tuesday okay. uh, going in It'll, the winter because okay. of, there's another program that's on Thursdays. So okay, we're, so we're, that'll be in. Tuesdays. On Tuesdays, starting on the 5th of January when the kids are back at school. Uh -huh. so. Oh, that sounds fun. So it's a good, nice little gathering after school. Yeah, we usually get uh, 15 or so kids. Wow. Um, a lot of them are, uh, our, our uh, policy is they need to be nine to be there by themselves. Okay. So we get fourth, fourth through sixth grade, and then some of the older middle school kids come in mm -hmm. and have a snack with us, too. And, and then there's um, an activity of some I usually kind. show a movie just if they want to watch the movie. Sometimes they stay for the whole movie. Sometimes they just stay for while they're having their snack, and then they go do homework. So. Yeah. But I have the room open till 5 if That's they want nice. to hang out and eat. Good. What are you doing in, in conjunction with Winter Carnival? Um, Winter Carnival, we are going to co-sponsor with the New London Police, a magic show on Friday the 29th. Mm -hmm. Um, we're having a magic a couple, uh, a, a husband and wife team, the Steel Graves, and they're going to put on a great family show for us. Nice. And then on Saturday, the library will be having crafts from 10 to 11. Okay. Um, we're going to be making little minion finger puppet <laughs> pencil toppers and something winter related, uh, okay. snowflake, uh, some snowflake crafts. So Super. they'll have people can sign up for that it's free but want to sign up just so we can have enough stuff for everybody. Right make sure you've got materials. Right. We were talking a little bit off camera and you mentioned the Great Stone Face. Tell us yeah. what that is. Oh it's a Children's Choice Award. I've been involved with that since 2002. Um, it's for it's targeted for grades four through six to keep mm -hmm. them going with enjoying reading and right. getting them into more difficult reading material. Um, it, we choose 20 books every year and the children will vote um, at school or in public libraries mm -hmm. uh, for their favorite and then uh -huh. we give an award uh, which oh. is a glass uh, sculpture designed by Peppy Hedron who's a New Hampshire artisan. Nice. Uh, it's a beautiful award um, and uh, been a, we, we are right now choosing next year's list which will be like re released in May but I wanted to let you know letting the kids know we have two copies of all of the books on the current list so there's plenty of books plus new books for them to read during winter break um, lots of great stuff to read that's super wonderful well good well what have you enjoyed most about Tracy in your couple months that you've oh, been here? Oh it's a beautiful facility uh, I just love the space and the families and the kids have been great um, everybody's been very welcoming and excited um, I'm just having a great time that's wonderful. Being very busy. Absolutely. It's a very active library. Yes. It's really a hub. I think a combination of where it is, very centrally located, mm -hmm. um, very close to bus stops, etc. Yeah. People really flock to our library. Lots of children after school, too. It's mm -hmm. nice to see them uh, coming to the library. Absolutely. Good, where we keep them reading. Yeah, yes. and studying. <laughs> and, yeah, just a gathering spot, too, right. for adults and children. <laughs> well, very good. Well, we've got the website up on the screen. That's the best way to keep up to date yes. on all the different things that are going on there. Um, and we invite our audience to come by and meet you as well. Sure. So welcome. Thank you. Thanks, Serene. Thank you.